with another exciting comic book accessory review. Today I have the Ultra Pro resealable comic bags that I purchased straight off Amazon for a nice price of $9.95. 100 bags in this pack. So that turns out to be about 10 cents each. Now keep in mind they also sell the regular bag versions, you know, for $7.40. So that's about 7 cents each. But today we're here to check out this. I've never had these bags before because I'm used to typical bags so you have to apply tape on the back. Now on detail, let's check out what the bag says. Stores current size comics up to 6, 7, 8 by 10 and a half inch. There you go, the, the SI units. Ultra clear, 2 mil thick material, 100% archival safe. 2 inch resealable flap closure. As the free bags, looking very proper. Okay, let's open it up like this. All right, so let's take a close up look at each bag. There you see it. There's the resealable option. I don't feel any stickiness to it, but let's see how this ah, works. Ah, so it looks like you have to peel this part to reveal the adhesive. Okay, so let's take a look at one of these comics, Guardians of the Galaxy. By the way, if you guys haven't seen that movie, you guys are missing out big time. One of the best movies of last year. Unbelievable. So here is a typical bag that I've been using all my life. You know, very traditional and cheap. You just have to apply tape and it's not resealable. So what I'm going to do is transfer one of these. Transfer this comic carefully. Actually, I'm going to use the backing board. That's the proper way of doing it. And let's see if it fits the board too. It's supposed to. Uh oh oh hold on a second why is this not fitting this is a normal size comic okay there we go maybe the bo that board particular board is a little bit too wide okay so there you go hmm that's pretty weird let me let me look for a different board Maybe a smaller one. I thought that's pretty standard size. Maybe I should... Hmm. That's pretty weird. You would think they would make it... Yeah, that's pretty standard size. So... I'm kind of thrown off by that. Okay, alright, forget about the board. But I'm just reviewing the bag. But now you know, you know... The traditional board doesn't really fit in there. It's weird. So I'm gonna peel this and close it like that. So that's the great thing about it. It's resealable. So you don't have any air or dust particles to contaminate your comic book. Very bona fide way of keeping and storing your comics. And let's open this bad boy back up again. Still sticky. What was it? All right. So I don't know if I ordered the wrong thing or not, wrong size. But I'm kind of thrown off by that. But I do like the product, and it's cheap, affordable. Not bad, not bad. So on a scale of one hundred percent, I would recommend this. But definitely check out the width size before you buy it. Don't make the mistake that I made. I would still recommend this product, you know. It seems like of high quality. And I definitely love the resealable option. On a scale of 100%, I'll give this an 82%. So thanks for watching and happy collecting. Well, since the Daredevil TV series is coming out, might as well try this one. Daredevil number 321. Glow in the dark cover, baby.
If you guys don't have this, you better go get it. Fall from grace. Hopefully this will fit. By the way, check out my Craigslist comic haul series, which I plan on doing regularly. Good way of finding great comics. Oh no, this is pretty tight. Oh, okay, it fits, it fits. Oh, come on, work with me. Work with me, baby. Don't be like that. Can handle rejection. Wow, this is very snug. Very snug indeed. What a perfect fit. Look at that. Hardly any gaps, so it doesn't really move around. This is the proper way to go, baby. Ah, oh, look at that. And it's got the resealable back too. You can't beat that. So anyway, thanks for watching.